DJ Dells. Brand new episode, last minute. Wanted to do a tribute video to the late, great Stan Lee. This man right here, man, when I was a kid, just, he just brought to me so much entertainment from all these comic books I used to read, man. I used to go every single weekend to Dragon's Den, Central Avenue on Yonkers, New York. If you're from the area, you know the place. If you're around my age, you remember that store, man. Legendary. Plus over in Dobbs Ferry, New York. Amazing Tales. I'm pretty sure that's what the store was. Amazing Tales. Used to go get a slice of pizza around the corner. My boy lived over there, so I used to get dropped off at his place. We used to skateboard down to this pizza shop around the corner. I think it was called um, Pizza Treat. I think that's what it was called. It was pretty good pizza back in the days, and I think they kind of fell off. That's what usually happens at pizza spots. But then we'd go to Amazing Tales, pick up all of our favorite Marvel comics, DC comics too, of course. And man, I used to just dig into these comics week after week and just love reading them. And they just take me somewhere, you know, and just let a young boy's imagination run wild. And I just got to thank Stan Lee for all the amazing work he put out throughout all the years. So here is some Funko Pops. I'll take them out of the box and everything, but I just wanted to shoot something last minute because when I heard the news today I just it just hit me in the chest man I was like damn I know he's 95 years old I know he lived an amazing life you know that's a pretty great life to live living to 95 years old so we got to celebrate it but still it was like wow it hit me in the heart man kind of like when I heard Carrie Fisher I mean that was at a whole nother level because I'm a huge Star Wars guy but we're focused right now on Stan Lee. I wanted to do something. I wish I had my comic books. They're over at my storage area. It's just going to be like impossible for me to get it today and be able to post a video today. So we do have a bunch of Stan Lee Funko Pops. So let's take some of these out of the box and we'll get close up and let's get into that. There they are out of the box. I'm gonna give you a detailed look individually at all three of them. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button if you have not yet for this video. Really appreciate it. And if you're watching this on my other channel, The Sneaker Addict, if you're digging this, make sure to go and subscribe to The Dell's Show on YouTube. And if you're watching this on The Dell's Show, thanks for tuning in. If you like sneakers, check out my sneaker channel over at The Sneaker Addict. So there's a close-up look at Stan Lee from Captain America, The First Avenger. Love, love this pop. Love the details. Really nice. Like that kind of like buckle on the hat. That logo looks sick right there in gold and the glasses look great there's a side profile quick look at his back and a look at his other side and then here's a look at stan lee from captain america the winter soldier great movie big fan of all the captain america movies looks really really awesome Hat looks awesome. The glasses look great. I love the like trim with the actual glass, which is translucent. Like it just looks really like a pair of glasses, and I appreciate those little details with his uniform. And it does say Stan right there on his tag, which is great. And then we got him from Guardians of the Galaxy with his funky glasses. Love it. And then there's a side profile. Kind of got to lean him up against <laughs> himself because he's like cannot balance, which stinks. He doesn't have a stand either. I wish he did, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a stand. I don't know why he doesn't. Bobblehead should always have stands just because they're too top heavy. They're going to fall. And I'm pretty sure you could get a few of these still, but you got to be on it fast. I will link it in the description box below be on it go and get it now because i'm telling you like everyone's going to buy them now now that he passed away it's sad that's just how it is when someone passes away a lot of collectors want to buy all the stuff up so if you want stan lee in your collection i'm pretty sure you still could get them i will link it in the description box but don't sleep on that as i said and um that concludes today's video i hope you guys had fun watching it I just wanted to shoot a little something and um let's just celebrate the life of oh, 
the legendary Stan Lee. Quick look at some of my other Marvel Funko Pops. Love this one right here of Thor. A few more right there. My Black Panther Funko Pops right there. There's Yondu, that's one of my favorites. Got Wasp Ant-Man right there. These Black Panther Funko Pops are dope how you have, you know, the end outfits when they're battling each other. Really cool. I like this one better though. This was executed better than this one as far as the paint. Both glow in the dark. This one you had to buy the t-shirt to get. It came in that pack where you had to buy the actual t-shirt. And um, this one is sick too because her wig actually comes off and you see her with the bald head and you got the real awesome design so it's a really must have from uh, the comic con exclusive really must have funko pop uh the star lord chrome awesome 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 pop such a big fan of guardians of the galaxy not only the movie but the comic books i have them still like the old old ones like i have a ton of them a ton of comic books sitting in old sneaker boxes like i gotta do a video on that if you guys want that let me know this is a cool carnage one too where he's transforming and this carnage one is badass also fye exclusive exclusive this is one of my favorite marvel funko pops by far the huge Thanos, the 10 inch Thanos is just ridiculous. Definitely one of my favorites to my collection in general. And the Hulk, the 10 inch Hulk, and the life size Groot. I mean, so good. I love collecting these Funko Pops. I mean, it's just so much fun. So much fun. <laughs> Look at Deadpool right there with the unicorn. This one too, another one of my favorites. The Hulk, busting out a Hulk buster. I wish this was a 10 inch. Can you imagine if it was that size? How sick would that be? I mean, it would be ridiculous. But yeah, man, just wanted to share some of my favorite Funko Pop Marvel figures, vinyls, whatever you want to call them. I just kind of just slowed down right there for a second. Also, this is a new one I just recently got, the Colossus. I needed a Colossus, and um, you know, believe it or not, I have no Wolverine, now that I think about it. I need a Wolverine Funko Pop, definitely. So hopefully I'll get one of those soon, and I uh, love this Captain America right here. I need one of Cap with the mask, though. I cannot believe I do not have a Captain America, like traditional Captain America. America Funko Pop so that should be something in the future that I will be getting my hands on really really awesome Funko Pop I've got so many more Funko Pops from Marvel. I'm just showing you some And that concludes today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it Definitely leave in the comment box below your favorite work from Stan Lee mine is definitely the amazing spider-man by far definitely my favorite leave your comments in the box Thanks for tuning in. And also let me know your favorite moment with Stan Lee as far as like him having a cameo in the movies. Because you know he always does these little cameos in all the Marvel movies which is a lot of fun. Let me know your favorite. I'd love to know. Leave that in the comment box below. I have a giveaway going on also. Look in the description box to enter that giveaway. Just watch the video and it'll give you all the information. I'm giving away two Funko Pops of Finn Bauer. So definitely check that out. Everyone have a blessed day. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you guys hopefully tomorrow with a new video. Definitely, actually. Definitely, we'll hit you with a new video tomorrow. Be out. I'm so happy he's back. Yeah, DJ Dallas. DJ Dallas. And your Benjamin. <laughs> Prepare the battlefield. Oh, massive, massive. That's right. Delete. 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 DJ Dallas. Send your Benjamin. Where's Vanguard 1? He's up to that, watching more. He's always surveillance. Oh, sure surveillance? Yeah. For security, right? Security purposes? Thank God. Thank God for him. I prayed for him when he was hurt. I prayed every night. He was drinking too much last night. I know. Oh, yeah? What were you drinking? Tequila? <laughs>
Oh, that's DJ Dells. Absolutely wonderful. Yeah.